uh, my dear friend, you accidentally left that ticket on my Mercedes. Uh, you were parked in a loading zone. That's because I was loading my mouth with Froyo. <laughs> <laughs> that is actor and comedian Maz Jabroni. Many fans will remember him from the CBS show Superior Donuts. Now he's getting ready to hit the stage this weekend at the Irvine Improv. And he is here to tell us more about the show and all his projects. I mean, you've got a lot on your plate. I think everybody does these days. Yeah. You know, I was here watching you. You're going from place <laughs> to place, That's right? True. That's true. And I think comedians now, we've got to be, we've, we, first of all, we've got to have social media going. You've got to have a podcast. You've got to be acting. Yeah. What happened to the good old days when you would just be trying to get on a sitcom like I was, <laughs> you know? Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. But this has to be fun for you because, I mean, you've done so many TV shows. I mean, countless, I won't even go down the list, but then when you go on stage, there's a whole different dynamic with the live audience. I love stand-up comedy, and I do it as much as I can. I tell my kids, I told my kids, I said, guys, I get to go tell jokes, make people laugh, connect with people, and then I get paid for it. So <laughs> yes. I said, who won? I said, I won, you know? Yes. And that's why I encourage all people, all young people, I say, find that thing that you love. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. So I've been doing stand-up now for 25 years. Wow. And it's so fun. It's changed somewhat because back in the day, again, you used to just go up and do your act. Yes. Now you got to talk to the crowd a little bit. You need crowd work because yes. we're all looking for the crowd work that then we post on our social media. Oh, and then people go, oh, yes. he's good at crowd work. But it's also fun for me to do crowd work. Yeah. So, well, and you go around the, the country and around the world, really. So <sighs> comedy is different in oh different gosh. places. Yeah, it is around. The, but I'll be honest with you. It's interesting because I've performed all over the world. Mm -hmm. um, I started performing in 2007. I was part of a tour called the Access of Evil Comedy Tour. Okay. And we took that to the Middle East. And when we used to go to the Middle East, originally they used to say, you can talk about whatever you want, but no sex, no religion, no politics. <laughs> you're like, and what's left? You're like, hello and good night, you know? <laughs> um, but no, recently I went back to the Middle East and I was able to do the same act that I was doing in America in the Middle East, oh. and the audience was enjoying it and they were into it because I think what's happened is social, social media. media. Yeah. So now all over the world, you go somewhere. If I go somewhere and I talk about something that just happened, in America, if I go to like, you know, uh, Amon Jordan and I mm -hmm. go, oh, did you hear about Kim Kardashian? They're yeah. like, of course we heard about Kim. Yeah. Everyone's heard about Kim Kardashian. Exactly. Um, so it's, it's pretty amazing that we can talk about whatever around the world and, 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 it, and it's, uh, it's, it's really worldwide these days. Yeah. And so you keep your plate full. What's next? What's next is I continue to tour. I'm on this tour called the Mr. International Comedy Tour. Okay. And what I've been having fun with is I've been taking people's comments, you know, on social media. Yeah. Talk about social media. So people, obviously on social media, you get 99 good comments, you get one bad comment. You're like, wow! Hey, hey, hey. So I've been taking those negative comments, bringing it on stage, uh. and making fun of it. And it's been therapeutic. Really? Can it's you give so us fun. one quick negative comment? Well, it's not the negative comment. I give you the, 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 what happened is at one point there was this one guy who got upset that I tried to do a Pakistani accent. Oh. And he hit me with six tweets back. To, I wasn't even, he was arguing with himself. At one point he was just like, I can't believe and he's going back and forth. <laughs> and it's just fun to read it. And, yes. and people are laughing. I'm laughing. And um, we all need to laugh because there's yes. so much negativity, yes. right? It's nice to have something to laugh at I'm and trying someone. To, I'm trying to turn, turn it, turn it around. <laughs> well, we appreciate you coming here to help us turn it around. And again, you're performing this weekend. You can find more information about Maz Jabrani, his comedy show at the Irvine Improv, and all of his projects by just going to our website, kcomnews.com, and clicking Scene on TV.